Hey there, welcome again. In this video, you can see how to detect safety alarms and treat for boiler. At first, let's see how to detect boiler water low and low low level alarms. Water level gauge with the level sensor is fitted in this boiler. Okay, let's test. At first, close stain in the bath to water level gauge. After then, close stain in the bath. Slightly open the drain bath and gradually drain water inside the level gauge. Close the drain bath when the low water level and low low water level alarms activate on panel. After alarms does have completed, open water in the bath to level gauge. After then, open stain in the bath. As a second, you can see high water level alarm testing. Water level inside the gate glass is going to rise up when the stain in the bar is closed. And then high water level alarm will activate on panel. Open stain in the bath and reset the alarm on panel by pressing buzzer stop and alarm reset buttons. Let's carry out the misfire and flame failure alarm testing. During the boiler firing, Pull out the flame ice sensor from its pocket. Combustion is going to stop and alarm will activate on panel. After that, mount the flame ice sensor into its position. As like before, press the buzzer stop and alarm reset buttons to reset alarm. Now you can see how to text ASO gas high temperature alarm. As usual, ASO gas high temperature alarm is set at 450 degrees centigrade. Reduce the high temperature set value and the current ASO temperature. ASO gas high temperature lamp activates and panel is going to trip. At first, press the buzzer start button. Reset the ASO gas temperature setting to original value. After that, press the reset and combustion buttons for next alarm testing. Let's carry out the fan abnormal stop alarm testing. Open the panel cover and pull out the treat buttons over the thermal overload relay. Fan anomaly stop alarm activates and combustion is going to stop. After that, press buzzer stop and alarm reset buttons to eliminate alarm. 
Please subscribe the channel and turn on notification bell for more update contents. Okay, let's start the stain low pressure lamp. At first, close the stain and above to pressure manifold. Open drain plug of the stem manifold carefully. At the time, ensure boiler is in combustion. Stain low pressure lamp is going to activate. Why slowly open the drain valve of the stem manifold? Before we set the lamp on panel, close the drain valve and open the inlet manifold valve. As the last one, you can see stain high pressure lamp testing at the stem manifold. During boiler is in combustion, intentionally activate switch of the stain high pressure transmitter. Stain high pressure lamp activates and panel will trip. A lamp setting values may vary, depends upon maker and types of the boiler. This video is based on manual boiler. Please don't forget to like and subscribe my YouTube channel for more informative content. Goodbye for now and hope to see you soon.